Get you the sweetest name. Yeah, I know. The music industry's top R&B and gospel artists came together over the weekend for BET's annual celebration of gospel. If you don't believe in God, you're lost. You know, so we need um, programs like this and shows like this and celebrations like this to remind us that we're never alone. Taraji P. Henson took over the role of Steve Harvey, who ended his historic 13-year run as the event's host. The one thing about church people, church folk, they make you feel welcome. They uplift you. There's no hateration going on here tonight. Everybody's in my corner um, praying for me to do a really good job. So it feels good. Gospel music is a genre that has helped a lot of other genres. It has spearheaded folks in R&B. You know, you look at your Patti LaBelle's and your Sissy Houston's and your Aretha Franklin's and your Eddie LaVert's. They all came out of the church. So I think we should always pay homage to the roots of our R&B singers. And from dynamic performances. I'm going to sing a duet with Vashawn Mitchell. I'm going to chase after you. To a touching tribute to gospel pioneer Richard Smallwood. It's wonderful when you you know, you've worked and worked and worked and people appreciate what you did. It was definitely a night to remember. We have to celebrate the word. I mean, God is good all the time and all the time God is good. He never fails. He can. He never fails. So and we have to celebrate that, you know, and I'm so happy that BET is the entity that can can showcase the celebration of gospel. I mean, as a kid, anybody that grew up, they know about church. <laughs> BET's annual gospel celebration premieres on Sunday, April 6th at 8 p.m. For HipHollywood.com, I'm Ashley Williams.